I think it's going to take a lot more, um, I guess, leadership mm-hmm. and commitment and maybe some external pressure. And I think, you know, to kind of force that change, because at the moment it's one of those things where um, it's not something that people are necessarily judged on in their KPIs. It's not going to come up in your annual review. It's not something, it's not like one of the bottom line issues, like how much money did you raise this, this year or how many campaigns did you win? Um, mm-hmm. so I think that it's just allowed to, um, to kind of simmer in the background. Um, and, uh, and it's going to take quite a lot of leadership and maybe just calling people out and to say, I, I think anyone that has an all, um, just given the origins of our sector, given the nature of um, the nature of the work that we do, the the global footprint, the people who are the who are the um, the people our work impacts the most. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it's it's hugely problematic if you have an entirely white leadership, yeah. and and I think that anyone who does um, should really be asking them, themselves themselves really asking themselves why and be committing to, to, to for that to be different and um yeah. but I don't think that pressure that external pressure to do that I don't think enough people are even saying that 